F09, which is the USS Thunderchild. It's an Akira class. Um, I might have a picture of it, unless you don't. If you don't know what an Akira class looks like, uh, there you go. That one at the bottom there. That's an Akira class. You may be thinking that looks like the Enterprise from Star Trek Enterprise, and you're kind of right. The base they designed in the Enterprise from this. But anyway, and. It's from the USS Thunderchild, which is, you first see it in Star Trek First Contact, it's the one that paggers the ball cube. So, and that's the origin of a name, you see? So there you go, next question is, if I could transform into anything, what would it be? Ooh. Probably Seven of Nan's skin tight uniform. No, it's too uh, Yeah, Princess Leia's gold bikini. No, two easy ones. Um... As Peter Griffin goes, farm of Karis Tampan. When he's when he's remembering being one of the uh, Wonder Twins. No, um, I don't know. That is an awfully good question, and I don't think I could answer it without going. But I, you know, probably I don't know. Maybe I don't know. Maybe a hand phaser. Uh, Moth P thirty eight Uncle Special. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I really don't know. Um, probably a jet fighter, probably an F-15, you know, one of these bad boys. And that's it for the first set of questions. Um, second question, the second set from the Redux version. Uh, Holy Grail, how close did I get to getting it? Well... My first paycheck from Phones for You, I went online to epicheroes.com and I got myself a masterpiece Megatron, which is up there. Check it out. There he is, next to me. Masterpiece Prime, G1 Prime, and a ball cube. Well, G1 Megatron was, was next to Masterpiece Megatron, but like I said, the most prized possession is that I transformed it into gun mode just so you could see it. And he's incredibly dusty. But yeah, I got me, I got it last year. And I'm chuffed with it. I love it. I think it's fantastic. But the only problem is, as as you should see yeah, Dianthus' video of his review of it, I haven't reviewed it yet. Um, Accessing. Sorry, it's just my computer making noises. Um, the only problem I've got with it is, when I first got it home and got it out of the box, I transformed it into robot mode, into gun mode. And the tiniest metal pin that connects his torso to his legs just sheared straight off. So now he's kind of a little bit lopsided and I really don't want to transform it because I don't want to lose that pin. Um, so yeah, um, that's the only thing. Anyway, next question is, what figure rocked my socks off this year? Um, well, to be perfectly honest... I haven't really bought any figures this year because of the fact that I'm unemployed and I ain't got that much money. But I really, what I've seen though, I have seen, I'm sure everybody's going to say the same answer Universe Cyclonus. Um, Universe Cyclonus. Because it just, because A, like Carlisle's Prime said, it's Cyclonus. And secondly, it's awesome. But, living in all, not a single dicky bird. And I just don't have the money to buy it off the internet at the moment. So, um, if anybody. Is, would like to send me one for free, I will take it, happily, happily take it, but chances are I'll, um, I'm going to get one at all assembly anyway, pick one up there, so that's probably get two, keep one in the packaging, because sometimes I like that, but I'll tell you what figure I did like though, which I bought, was animated jazz, I thought it was pretty fucking cool, except his weapons though are a bit lame, his sort of nunchucky things, but I thought it, was, I, it looks well, it feels really nice, well built, well put together, and it transformed real nice. I'm not going to do it now, but but yeah, I think that's that's the figure that I've got that's wrapped my world. So yeah, the next question is biggest change in my personal life from last year. Got sacked from Friends View, and I became single again. And that's pretty much it. I don't really want to go into it over the internet. Um, those who know me know why. Um, but yeah, I'm not. I'm not going to go into it over the over the Tinder web. Um, but yeah, um, 
So that's all I'm going to say on that, really. Ah, oh, my nephew was born as well last year. Uh, my second nephew. Um, and he had his birthday a few months ago, so which was nice. And he's just learning to talk, little shitbag he is. And yeah, I'm, I'm sure I'll upload a video of him, he's pretty cool. Uh, but yeah, that's pretty much the biggest change, really, in my personal life. Uh, next question is. Um, biggest reviewer? Um, I'll say, I said Diantis, but he keeps. I'll say Diantis again, Silverball, because he keeps coming back with some entertaining videos. I mean, he's always entertaining. Um, he's a, he seems like a cool dude. Um, like I say, he's, he's probably one of the reasons why I'm been inspired to do more videos. Uh, Kalil Prime. Um, I've been watching like every video he's ever done this last like couple of this last week and a half. Um, and today I've been I saw Copper Commander TFW. He does some good videos and decompose again. Uh, again he pulls it out of the bag. Um, and I'm watching all these videos and I'm sort of like learning my craft, so to speak. Because I'm only this this video will be number five. Um, so I'm learning my craft. I'm kind of basing my ideas on my videos on. Um, the way Silverbolt does it, but I'm getting there, so, but yeah, um, that, uh, Kyle Pran has been a big help and a big influence why I'm, you know, uploading, so, and there you go, the next question is, uh, my least favourite Transformer, now that is a very interesting question, and I was going to say, my least favourite would probably be Ironhard from Energon. No, 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 no. Kicker and Ironhard from Energon. Kicker, I could kick until my foot came off. And then I'd use my other foot to kick him to death with. And then I would set him on fire. Then I would put more petrol on him. Then I'd encase him in concrete. And then do anything I could think of. Because I just hate him. Hate him, hate him. But... The actual Transformer f character itself would have to be, you know, R.I.D. Megatron as well. He just, well, his voice annoyed me to for one thing, and he just, compared to how good Beast Wars was, and that's the next series. Well, Beast Wars, Beast Machines, and then the next series to come out was R.I.D. Now it's quite funny in parts. I mean, I did like the whole Skybite was cool. I like the Autobot Brothers. I like Prime. I like the Spy Changers. I like um, Slapper. Nice. Is it Nice Scream? Dark Scream, whatever he's called. And, and Spitter. They were quite cool characters. But Beast, but R.I.D. Megatron was a whiny little son of a bitch. And I just didn't like him. So, yes, there's my questions for getting to know Transformers fan and Transformers fan Redux. Um, I'm going to upload this now and um, probably come back with another video. So I will catch you later and uh, toodle-oo.